if you know that you cannot afford designer bags and shoes just yet but you still want to add luxury items to your wardrobe collection then this video is for you because in this video i will share tips that will help you and also a list of wardrobe items that you can start with as you build your luxury wardrobe collection hello ladies welcome to another video my name is ayani may and if this is your first time do subscribe but if you are already a subscriber thank you so much for being a part of this community if you are an african lady living in Africa then you will find this channel very useful because my videos are tailored for us African women leveling up our lives while also living in Africa. Ladies it is alright to want luxury items because they have a way of making you feel good they have a way of making you feel a million bucks and I can dare say that it can boost your self-confidence give you a sense of belonging and also raise your social standards so you should desire luxury items the goal here is to plan and work towards building your collection bit by bit without putting a financial plan in jeopardy the last thing you want to do is to go broke or start borrowing money all because you want to buy luxury items so before i share the list of wardrobe items you can use as foundation to build your luxury collection let's start with the tips because you need to know these tips this way you are better prepared to shop luxury tip number one is to start within your budget if you set your eyes on luxury items that are way above your financial level then you are going to put yourself in jeopardy you are also going to start having this feeling where you are discouraged because you feel like it's not attainable or oh, hermes bag to 20 million naira i can't buy you start to feel that way you want to start with luxury items that are within your budget and build from there you start small bit by bit bit by bit until you get to the larger luxury items even the most luxurious brands have wardrobe items that you are likely going to be able to afford and in a minute i will share those items with you tip number two is to save towards it like I mentioned in my video, how to level up your life in 2022, where I'll leave a card in the video. I talked about making sure that this year you level up your financial life. You save and you invest. You also have a side hustle. That is still in play. That is why for you to buy these luxury items, you need to save towards it. If it's going to take you three months, four months, five months, they're luxury items. And if you buy the classic ones, they won't go out of style. So save towards it. Take your time. If all you can buy in a year is to luxury items, that's fine. It's a marathon, not a sprint. Don't take your salary, take your investment money, take your savings to buy these items. No, you want to save towards buying these items specifically. That way, when you buy it, you're not going broke. You're not worried about where your next income is going to come from or where you're going to find your next food. Tip number three is to shop sales. Yes, luxury brands also have sales. They have Christmas sales, New Year sales, Valentine's Day sales, Easter sales, International Women's Day sales. So there are so many sales for you to plan for. The websites I will recommend, especially if you are in Nigeria where we don't have these luxury stores are Farfetch, Netta Potter, and Nordstrom. With these three online stores, you can get luxury items from them. I particularly like Netta Potter because they have a UK online branch and you know to ship from UK to Nigeria is a bit quicker compared to shipping from the US to Nigeria. With the right company, you can have your items within three to four business days. So make sure to check out these websites. And the final tip has to do with the ladies who have wealthy or affluent men in their lives. Whether you're dating them or they're just that wonderful, generous friend, ask them for luxury items as gifts. Some men don't know what to get women. And oftentimes you will hear questions like, what would you like for Valentine's Day? Or what would you like for your birthday? Simply present them with a wish list of luxury items you would like to add to your wardrobe collection. Now, approach matters. You don't want to just say, I want to buy a Hermes slide. No. You can say, babe, I would like to own a pair of Hermes slides. I, I know you like it when I dress well. And with this particular brand, if I buy one, I wouldn't need to buy another one for a long time. Do you think it's something that you can get for me? I'd really appreciate it. And if he's a man that enjoys spoiling you, he'll say, of course, how much is it? Let's go 
get some slights. <laughs> so make sure that you approach the man properly. You don't want to sound entitled or demanding. Always make sure to request for items in a way that will benefit you and also benefit them. Ladies, if you are enjoying this video, do hit the like button and also subscribe. Don't forget to leave a comment letting me know if you have any luxury item in your wardrobe and how you got started buying them. I'll be interested in reading your comments. Now on the list, I have 10 items here and I will share some of the brands that I like for some of the items but you can always do your own research and see what brand fits you best. The first item here is sunglasses. Even the most luxurious brands have sunglasses for $200 to $5,300. So this is something you can invest in. The second clothing item you can add to your wardrobe is a silk scarf. And most luxury brands have silk scarf for under $200. So if you want to add something simple to your wardrobe that you can style with your workwear, you can start with a silk scarf. The third is a reversible belt. I particularly like this because if you can invest in one solid luxury belt, it means you get to have two belts in one. With the reversible belt, you can wear one side and then switch it and wear the other side. My recommended color would be black and brown because these colors go easily with other things that you have in your wardrobe. Number four, hats. For hats, if you are a lady that loves hats or you want to start trying out hats, you can have luxury hats like Gigi Peep. Gigi Peep is not really luxury luxury, but I particularly like their company image and the styles they have because they look really lovely, really feminine, really beautiful. So this is another wardrobe item you can consider adding to your wardrobe. Number five is makeup luxury makeup like Fenty, Dior. You can find, even with eye pencil, lipstick, lip gloss, something that when you whip out and you use in public, people are going to say, oh, Fenty lip gloss or Dior lip gloss. All right? So makeup is also something you can buy from luxury brands. But make sure you don't buy things like foundation or powder that can finish too quickly, especially if you cannot maintain that pace. That is why I recommend lipsticks or lip gloss or even eye pencils. Number six, skincare products. You can buy certain high-end skincare products or even skincare product applicators like the Jade Stone rollers, the brush you use in scrubbing makeup off of your face. You can get these items from luxury brands and just have it as part of your self-care or skincare routine. Number seven, perfumes and body spray. Stop buying a bulky perfume. Time to <laughs> invest in high-end perfumes and body spray so that you can smell well and smell well for a long time also. I have three perfumes I use and that is Black Opium Sea Intense by Jojo Armani and Rose Woman by Zara. Rose Woman by Zara is a simple perfume I use at home if I'm just running a quick errand. Number eight is lingerie. Yes. Invest in lacy feminine luxury lingerie. Two brands that I like is Nubian Skin and Agent Provocateur. I hope I'm pronouncing that right. They have really beautiful, beautiful lingerie sets. And trust me, you're going to feel very feminine, very alluring, very womanly when you put on this particular lingerie because I mean, you spend good money on it. Number nine, sleepwear. You can look for luxury sleepwear from luxury brands so that on those days when it feels like the world is turning upside down, you can simply do your bedtime routine and then put on your silk expensive sleepwear and go to bed feeling like a million bucks. And finally, jewelry. Jewelry is a luxury, but here is a tip I have for you. Instead of going for brand names like Cartier and Tiffany, especially if you cannot afford it just yet, invest in solid gold jewelry. That way you can have something solid in your wardrobe. There's a stud earring I wear so often, and most people always ask me or always say, you like this earring so much. Well, I do because it's solid gold and I know how much I, I bought it. So even if it's to buy one solid earring, but you know that one is one, it's not going to fade, it's not going to wash, then go ahead and invest in your jewelry. So there you have it, ladies. Tips that can help you start your luxury wardrobe collection alongside 10 items that you can start with. Do subscribe, like, share, and also leave comments in the comment section. Oh, another thing, do turn on post notification by hitting that bell right there so that you do not miss any new videos that I upload. I will leave one of my videos on how you can elevate your style so that you can learn how to switch certain clothing items for others. This way you will look more elegant and sophisticated. As always, be kind to yourself and I will see you in the next video. Bye!